might want to get out of New York, lay low for a while. I hear Florida does. That's not a bad idea. What do we know down there? That's why I don't drive! Remember Is this Mr. Dominic? Roth? Yes. Wonder what he's Who's up this? To? Hyman Roth. We met in Cuba, remember? Of course. Mr. Roth, how are you? Good. News travels fast, my friend. I've heard you've made quite a name for yourself in New York. Thank you. Dominic, I'll be quick. I have an opportunity for you here in Florida. I'd like to speak with you in person. Fredo's here too. He can meet you at the airport. Until then, take care. <laughs> You know where the airport is, right? Yeah, Professor. I know where it is. Would you like a ticket, sir? Have a pleasant flight, sir. Fredo! Oh, there's even better town on the beach. Yeah? Oh, yeah. You're gonna love Florida. Let me take that. Let's go. So, Carmine Rosado, he's, um... He's not gonna be bothering us anymore. It's Tony's family. Hey, watch it! Easy, easy. You don't know how to drive down here. These gang of small potatoes, they ain't the reason Mr. Roth called you. He mentioned a family. Yeah, the Granados. Ever since Cuba, it's been nothing but war with those guys. What's their business? Guns, girls, whatever they can get their dirty hands on to make a buck. And their boss, old man Rico, <laughs> he's trouble. Made his money in construction. Probably buried a body under every house he's built. But he's connected all the way to the top. Is that so? That's why Mr. Roth called you here. Well, hopefully I'll like what Mr. Roth has to say. I hate Florida. Too human. I like Fredo. He's a good guy. Yeah, he knows all the hot spots in Florida. If you want to get laid while you're here, he's the man to talk to. Mr. Roth once rigged the World Series. Not because he had any money on it, but just because he wanted to see the series go to seven games. Mr. Roth, how are you? I haven't seen you since... Not since Cuba. I heard you got out safe. I'm sorry about Aldo. He was a good man. Thank you. He was a good boss. My friends tell me you're a good boss, too. A great one, in fact. A man who knows how to get things done. Lead in battle. You know how to take out a family. You mean Carmine Rosado? I mean the Granados. They're pricks. Especially their boss, Rico. He pulls a few connections downtown, and suddenly he thinks he runs everything. He's got no respect. So why don't you do something about it? Because they've kidnapped one of my men. I can't make a move while the Granados have a hostage. They're watching me, but they're not watching you. Rescue him, Dominic. And I'll know that what they say about you is true. I'll know I made the right call. These kidnappers...
Your man's safe, Mr. Roth. He may be a little scratched up, though. He's seen worse, believe me. To show my thanks, I want you to have this home. It used to be my safe house during the Prohibition. Today, it's yours. I appreciate that. Thank you. So, Prohibition, huh? This place must have quite a history. There might be a few casks of rum still buried in the Foundation somewhere. But, Dominic, I didn't contact you only about the house. There's one other thing I wanted to tell you. You, of all people, should know how important a capo can be for a family. You really should promote one of your men. Appoint him as your cabo regime. Being a leader will make him stronger, and he can do more for the family. This is important, Dominic, because the Granados and Tony Rosado will be coming for you, and you must be ready for them. All right, boss. Let's roll. Your fucking rampages need to stop. Not a bad place, huh? I prefer to sweep back at my hotel, but hey, beggars can't be choosers, right? Think about it, Fredo. If I take out the Granados, the money I can make here, it'll be like robbing Fort Knox. Well, the Granados ain't just gonna roll over because you said boo. You gotta get an upper hand first. No one to call in a favor. Like if someone you know has an ammo connection, call them before a fight. Maybe a cop loses some evidence, get a guy out of jail. Hell, even a G-man could call in a sting for you. Everyone keeps saying that Rico Granados is connected, that he has friends in high places. What do you know about that? Yeah, the mayor, police chief, even some of the union bosses. Rico's got them all in his pocket. But if you do them a favor, they might do something nice in return. It's worth paying those guys a friendly visit. Exchanging favors with an ordinary man is one thing. But having a judge, DA, or police chief in your pocket means you have influence. Get a union boss on your side, and he can order his men to rebuild the bomb business. Some people can spring your men from prison or a hospital, call off the police when they're on your tail, or even put a rival family member behind bars for a while with a sting. Best thing about these favors is that they can be called in at any time. It pays to have friends in high places. 